The Abu Ghosh Vocal Music Festival is a very special event, a days-long celebration of classic music, much of it with Christian roots, performed in an Arab village outside of Jerusalem and performed by mostly Jewish musicians. Well, this here a performance of Johann Sebastian Bach's St. Matthew Passion will undoubtedly be one of the centerpieces of this fest, and with me now is Yuval Ben Ozel, the man who will conduct the orchestra for Bach's St. Matthew Passion. Yuval, thank you for joining me. Hello. It's not only orchestra, it's four soloists and a choir, uh, so it's a big... So it's huge. Yeah, it's, it's huge. huge. Apparatus, yes. Wow, and I know that it's going to take place in the church in Abu Ghosh, right? I mean, it's a very special way to experience this it box is. piece. You know, church music is meant to be played in a church, sure. and then the acoustic is appropriate, and the whole atmosphere is appropriate, and, and the experience of the listener is great. Sure, and also the acoustics of being in like a stone church is very, you know, it's very unique, and you can imagine Bach like either keeping that in mind when he composed it and wrote it and stuff like that. Why, now tell me a little bit about how the performance goes because I know that there's an evangelist who performs with the orchestra, right? That's kind of like a chanting, like singing the, the not a prayer, but singing kind of like lyrics with the piece, right? Yes, you know, it's one of the major masterpieces of, of the whole sure. Western you know, culture. And it's because it's a combination of Bach, great, ability, he was a genius, and a great dramatic te text, and uh, choir and soloist, and all based on a text from the, um, you know, St. Matthew, right. uh, Passion from the New Testament, and, and it's just a really a very unique combination. Yeah, well Bach in Israel is, you know, interesting because, you know, a lot of anti-Semitism is in that history, and a lot of Israelis that I know they won't listen to Bach in Israel because for them it brings up bad memories, probably in line with the music and with the sounds. Does that enter into your mind when you're composing or when you're selecting music to play or when you're playing this, this it's an, composition? It's, yeah, it's not really Bach. Bach. Most of the pieces of Bach, are, you know, many of them are from the Bible, from, mm -hmm. from Psalms, but the, this um, St. Matthew Passion is a some of it is anti-Semitic text, but it, it's not really anti-Semitic. It's just the story from the Evangelion it, it gives the role of the bad people to the Jewish sure. people who blame Jesus for, for things, and they choose to, to crucify him or to, you know, they, they ask the Romans to crucify him. So it's, it has some elements, but it's if we, we uh, but we treat it like as a theater, as, sure. as a piece of art, and, and we're not trying, yeah, and history, yeah. and we're not, try, I'm not trying to identify with, with the story, but, but to, to, to play a great piece sure. and put it in proportion. The, the concert's in September, there's a lot to look forward to, you've all, good luck, break a leg, thank, thank you for joining you. us.